All right, welcome back, knights. More Dragon Quest builders. This one is a recording, not a live stream. John is here. What is going on, guys? John missed the first half. So, John, basically, I was abducted by monsters. Okay. And uh, the monsters praised this human who turned himself into a monster. And then he was killed by the heroes of Dragon Quest 1. Okay. And uh, that that human who turned himself to a monster, he's dead. Long dead. This game takes place hundreds of years later. And for some reason, there he is, right there. Malroth. The only difference is he doesn't know who he is. He has no memory. Don't okay, ask. I was gonna say that, like, don't ask me why, why he's here or when this game. Because I'm not exactly sure what happened. So the monsters that captured me, our boat capsized in a storm, and I got swept away by the ocean. So I don't know if maybe I died or something. But there you go. That's your recap. Evil dude, there. I have to rebuild the world. And that's it. I feel like I oversimplified that. I missed a lot of stuff, but you'll catch up as we go. I just discovered yeah, my oh, first new world. <clears throat> well, go back and watch the live stream. This island is pretty. <laughs> John, you should close your room door. <laughs> this me, this island is pretty weird. Don't you think, Jules? The trees are all withered. The grounds gross and slimy and the whole place stinks like someone left a sack of apples in the sun for a month. Do you really think we'll find the greenery we're after in a slimy stinky place like this? Maybe. Huh? Whoa, what the heck's that? It's some kind of pink pulsating thing. But what is it? Ew. It looks like a heart. I think it's some kind of fruit. I wonder. I wouldn't eat that. Why is it pulsating? And there's smoke coming out of it. It's obviously poisonous. Do you reckon this whole thing's edible or? Called it. Blah! This stupid thing just blew up in my face! And what a stink. It turns into the dirt around it all gross and slimy too. Oh, that explains why the ground is purple. Ha ha ha! I've heard of fruit going off before, but not like that. This place is crazy. Huh? What are you looking at, dude? I smell a fight brewing, Jules. Over there. Wow, there's a person all over there. Leave me alone. There's no point trying to eat me. I'm nothing but skin and bone. Sounds like fun. Come on, let's go and see what all the screaming's about. I don't think that's your first idea when it comes to a scream, but okay. Well, this dude... This dude loves fighting. It's literally... Oh so, oh, so he's literally like a Goku. Yeah, but he likes to kill people. Like, the first NPC we came across together, he recommended we put her out of her misery. Even though she was perfectly fine. Hmm. Very interesting. And then... This motherfucker smacked his ass? He smacked his ass. Wow. You piece of shit! That's why you dead. I mean, I mean, you should turn around and beat their ass. I mean, look, you give him the stick like he's a fucking chunkla. <laughs> that's the one thing I love about this game—the fucking high five mechanic. Oh, that's amazing. That'll teach those monkeys to mess with us. Right, time to get some info out of Sally. Screams a lot. Hey, oh, if you guys don't know what a chancla is, it's a sandal. It's a slipper. Yeah, that's slipper Spanish sandal. people use to beat their children. <laughs> so this is how I die, as dinner for a big stinky ape. I hope I give them horrible indigestion. And there she is. Balma. Well, Toriyama hey. didn't even try. Wait, the yeah, monsters, they're gone. Really Bulma. Those scaredy cats must have turned tail and fled when they finally worked out who they were dealing with. I know I killed them. Hmm? Since... When have you two been standing there? Since forever? 
Did you beat the monsters? Oh, I see. Thanks for your help. My name's Rosie. What's yours? And what are you doing here? He's Malra, the amnesiac. Like I said, John, he remembers nothing. He has amnesia. And you're yeah. Jules, the apprentice builder. I am a master builder. Did you not see my videos on, Dra on Dragon Quest Builders 1? Hello. And you've come here to find out how to add a little greenery to your island. You know going around telling everyone you're a builder is risky business. There's no telling how they might react. Why is that a problem? Everyone keeps saying okay. that. If I told you I was an architect, would you shoot me? You're lucky you met me, and I might be lucky that I met you. Hmm. Oh, really? Alright, my mind's made up. You can't make an omelet without breaking a few rules. As the finest farmer of Furrow Field, it is my duty and pleasure to give you the grand tour of its finest farm. Come on, follow me. Who fucking said that, though? Break a... That, yeah, okay, that's not the same. Well, I think, I think that's the, the Japanese to English translation. <laughs> okay. okay. <laughs> I'm, I'm just saying, first off, we have a Bulma. I don't know if it's because she's chibi, cat size. I love the chibi. She's kind of fat. I'm sorry, hey. she's kind of fat, though. What's wrong with being a little plus sized? This Bulma no, obviously I mean... loves steak. Hello, Bulma. I mean, but you know Bulma, Bulma. Well, here we are. Furrow Field Farm. The greatest, greenest... That's purple. Garden on the island. How do you like it? Uh, I don't mean to burst your bubble, but it's not that great. It's not very green. It isn't even a garden. I love this guy. <laughs> He's so fun. Oh, I know. That's because we haven't built it yet. Furrowfield used to be a plant lover's paradise. The vegetables and flowers growing everywhere and anywhere. But then the spoil spores appeared and turned all the earth into horrible stinky slime. You can hardly even grow weeds in it. There was once a great farm here. The biggest and brightest on the whole island. And if all of us put our minds to it, I think we could bring it back. All of us? Oh shit, there's people in the background. Are those guys mixed up in this too? Hello, people. Why does this dude look like John! fucking Hercule? Yo, I just thought the same thing! <laughs> what the f- Okay, I know Akira Toriyama was just like, you know what, let me just uh, <laughs> just put some of the characters in here, but gosh, it's fucking Come, lazy! Come, Perry, there must be something we can do. This is the last of our wheat, not to mention the soil we've scanned enough. Horrible earth as it is. I won't stand so close if I were you, Mr. Bonanzo, sir. This er spo this year spoils look like it could go off any minute. Why would they farm it right next to the thing that explodes? They're so dumb. Suffering slimes. Bonanzo, Perry, are you alright? Quick, you two. We have to get over there and make sure they're okay. Wow, he look at it. he's he walking away. Wow. <laughs> He's like, they're fucking useless. <laughs> hey, yo, fuck those guys. Bonanzo, oh, no, Perry, are you alright? Oh shit, they walked away. <laughs> we are, Rosie, but alas, our weed is not. That spoil spore just obliterated the entire crop. Hmm? Who are you two, pray tell? I've not seen your faces before, and to be honest, I think I rather liked it that way. What a douche. This is Jules, and this is Malra. Jules says she's a builder. Blimmin' heck! What kind of maid goes around here telling everyone- Why do people keep freaking out when I say that? She must have something wrong with her head. Well said. Listen here, young Rosie. You may have fooled us this far. But we shall not be taken for ninnies. ninnies. If you honestly expect- It's because they're supposed to be British. If you honestly expect us okay. to believe that this so-called builder will somehow salvage this preposterous plan of yours, you are gravely mistaken. Come along, Perry. We're leaving. Wow, Perry must be the bottom, bitch. I see how it is. Yeah. You must face facts, my dear. Furrowfield Farm is gone. The dream is over. And it is time to wake up. Bitch, I'm a master builder. Ah, that stuck up beardy cloak really rubbed <laughs> me the wrong way. Still, facial hair, felonies aside, he's got a point. 
There's no point trying to rebuild this farm if the soil's no good. You're wasting your time. No, I'm not. It's the finest farmer on the furrow field and Jules, a real live builder. If we work together, I know we can do it. I don't need you. I can do it on my own, but that's okay. Wow, you really don't know when to give up, do you? <sighs> Why do we want to rebuild this place anyway? Why? It's like Bonanza said. It's my dream. A dream, huh? Fuck your dream. You, you know, I've never really got my head around all this hopes and dream stuff people go on about. Right. Please, Jules. I can't do it on my own. You'll help me rebuild Furrowfield Farm, won't you? No. <laughs> but, but why? We both want the same thing. Please, Jules. Will you help me rebuild the farm? I just want to build a farm on my land, not <laughs> yours. Wow, it just really just forces you. Oh. Wow. Sure. Now I've got a builder on board. The farm's as good as built. Jules, Malwalk, welcome to the team. We're going to make this place the best wow, farm ever. Wow, like I had an option. Let's get started then, shall we? The first thing we need is a is a field to plant our crops in. Hmm. Where's the best place to put it, I wonder? If only we had some kind of sign. God, send us a sign. Ah, I have an idea. Oh yeah, that's my architect book. Anytime I think of an idea, I actually write it down. Hello. That's you got very close. Handy. What's the matter, Jules? You're looking very pleased with yourself. I am an architect. You've worked out how to build a scarecrow? Of course, scarecrows are found in fields. If we stick on the ground, everyone will know where our new field is. So where should we put it? In the middle. Oh, I know just the spot. There's a little bit of good, clean soil over there. I'm so excited I can hardly wait to start telling, tilling the soil. Well, not until you officially mark the... With the sc okay, yeah, I get it. Yeah, I know. I need I the mean, materials. I don't know how she knows that by just looking from that distance. Hold oh, on. Whatever. Okay. And uh, she said I needed wood too, right? Yeah. Crap. Hold on. Let me see this. That's the table. I need wood and, and dry grass. Okay. Wood. Can I just hit the tree? I yeah, I can just take the tree down. There you go. Dry grass. This is dry grass. These like dried up plants. Yeah. You wouldn't happen to have seen how much I needed, did you? I want to say like four each, but I could be lying. Alright, uh, it's fine. It's fine. Not a big deal. I was sort totally of lying. Yeah, you were wrong. <laughs> I need one more. Stop climbing. Bam. Alright. Can only make the one. When you place a scarecrow on the ground, the farmer will hoe any nearby earth and turn into tilled soil. That's ready for sowing. Well, she just said that before, but whatever. Bam. Is that what I think like it is? Whatever. Well, she's the farmer. She's gonna do all the hard part. I just had to do this. Okay. Oh, I have to wait for her to. No, no, do your thing. Uh, uh, I have to wait I was for her to. Say, is that is it? Is that attempted murder? Like she trying to smash the shit on your head? Like. <laughs> I really gotta sit here and wait. No way to like. What the fuck you know, did I just pick animal? up? A strange something. It's a heart. What does it do? Ah, farming so much fun. I'm so happy I could pop. You look pretty cheery just now, too, waving your arms in the air with that big grin on your face. What was that? No one else could see the heart but me? 
Something popped out of me and you just picked it up. I didn't feel like I was bursting gardening glee just now. Maybe, just maybe, some sort of happiness actually burst out. Well, whatever it was, I'm sure to come in useful. And uh, blah blah blah, make sure you scoop them up. Yeah, I... Wait, wait, to show their enjoyment well, appreciation. What does it do? John, read the thing on the side. While I pick up I anything disappear. she drops. Fuck. You're not grateful, bitch? I'd feel... There you go. Keep being grateful. Oh, I think it's like a relationship meter. Because if you look at the top left, it says plus one with her every time I pick something up. So you guys become lesbians. No, just friends. Jesus. Oh. Well, She's you said done. relationship. I was like, okay. It's a relationship a meter. Nice. I mean, I'm sure I could do better than her. <laughs> oh. Farming for Ness will build. Uh, I knew there was something special about you from the moment we met. After all, not everyone would risk their life telling a stranger they're a builder. Why? I don't understand the issue here. You don't see what's so dangerous about that. We've been living on the rocks that everyone knows that builders are the enemy. What? But anyway, we'd better get back to business. We have a field. Wait, why are builders the enemy? What? Isn't but isn't your job to build the world again? So why why would they But I'm not, it's not like I'm the only builder in existence. I'm an apprentice. I have a master and everything. Right now that the soil is all ready, the next thing to do is to plant some seeds. Here you go, Jules, all for you. Cabbage seeds. Okay. Yay. To be honest, plowing is easy peasy. Anyone with a hoe can do it. But it takes a steady hand and a keen eye to plant uh, a I'm not doing uh, oh. this. She said hoe. Look at this. She made it seem hard. I'm just going to do that. And that. And that. It'll take care of itself. And there you go. Ooh! Why is she clapping um, your face like? It's just because I'm close. I'm, she's fulfilling her dream. Stop making me reopen the dialogue and just continue the dialogue. Thanks to you, we have ourselves a fully plowed and planted field. Not fully. That, uh, that whole half hasn't been touched. Yeah. The only thing left is to water the seeds. You see that little hill over there? Now I do. There's a spring at the very top, but it's a bit of a pain to climb all the way up, okay? And that water looks kind of dirty. Just yeah, that's so you come in. Can you build something that would make it easier for us to get the water? Some sort of irrigation station. Here comes the notebook. What? Whoa. Wait, did she oh, no, no, no. what? No, no, okay, she's an architect, what? so she just made a blueprint, that was all. It's a blueprint, it's a blueprint. Oh, okay. She, it's I a blueprint. I was looking at it, I was like, what? And she literally just drew out on the land, okay. 23 spoiled soil, and one blockage? Oh, it just has to be in that order. Yeah. Okay. Spoiled soil. It's like the one you drew back on the island, but it looks like we'll have to gather the materials for this one ourselves. Okay, spoiled soil. Just smash up the ground if you need some. That's hold it. Okay, yeah, sure. Stop wasting my time. I know! She sure talks a lot. That's spoiled soil. Okay. Whoops, didn't mean to take the dirt. Hey, you can have that one. Ah, oh, crap, I did it again. I only need 24. Why don't I just do it here? That would make more sense. Oh, look 
at that, you grabbed everything. Pretty much, it's spoiled. If only building was that simple. Oh my god. I'd be an architect. <laughs> well, it said 24! Oh wait, were they not supposed to be too high? So... Mistakes from me? Nope. Yeah, they, they weren't supposed to be too high. Okay. Mistakes have been made. Thank God, destruction is this so easy in this game. It seems like everything is this fucking easy in this game. Hey, but well that's the beauty. Oh fuck, that's the beauty of it. You know how long it would take to make an irrigation system in real life? Probably about like a year, maybe six well, months. Well, I mean, depending on how big it is, but yeah, yeah. some time. I think I did it. Why do I still have one left? Is it the blockage that you needed? Yeah. Where? What? I think you might oh, climb all the way up I gotta there. destroy yeah. that. How come First the water off, doesn't overflow? It looks nasty as hell. Oh, I, I love that high fucking five, man! Nice work, Jules. Whatever this thing is, it looks just like the blueprint. Wow! Now we got ourselves an irrigation station. We can water the fields. I can't thank you enough, Jules. Watering plants is a lot of tilling soil. Any old idiot can do it. Okay, yeah, listen. Just stand back and... Okay. Oh, okay, Bulma, thank All you. Alright, more hearts. Do I need to talk to him? Okay, so what am I supposed to do? I have to wait. Did she come all the way up here for the water after I just put it down there? Bitch, you better use the water down here. Oh, John, look, that's kind of cool. Look, it's yeah. soggy. From the water. I mean, it's it's spoiled, right? So what did it show? No, I'm just saying, like, that's kind of cool that they actually programmed that in. Oh, she dropped hearts. That's right, love me. There we go, Jules. All our thirsty little seeds. Okay. That's all there is to it. Just the soil, plant some seeds, water them, then wait. It's easier said than done, though. For one thing, you need healthy soil. Yeah, I know that. It's easy to tell if the soil spoiled if it goes all purple and sticky whoa sometimes if it looks green there's moss growing on top but when you dig down blah 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 grimy slime let's take a look at the soil okay all right jules there's only one thing left to do before we can harvest our crops wait for them to grow First we'll get little sprouts, then a little water, and growing leaves. Before we know it, they'll be all grown up. When that time comes, you won't need any special equipment to harvest them. Just hit them with that cypress stick, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, oh, that I know. Hmm, it might be a while before they're ready to be harvested, though. In the meanwhile, you could pass the time by clearing away some rocks and weeds in our future fields, and you could plant some... What a bitch. I'm just an errand boy for you. Speaking of which, here's a few more added in the way. You might as well go ahead and plant them. Why can't you just give me everything at once? But okay. I could have did this before. Exactly. That's why I don't understand what she didn't give it to you before. But once whatever. you've grown... Once you've sown your seeds, it'll be some time before they fully grow crops. Or... Okay. I really have to, like, do all of them? Mm -hmm. 
A nice long chat? No, no. No, I don't want to chat. I don't want a long one. I feel bad forever this person ever Where's Malraw? Yeah, I'd rather talk to him. Looks like four hours to stop out around here for a while. As well as it can't hurt to go along with her plans. Uh, uh, let's see what she has to talk about. I've got a solid 12 hour. Trivia, what? What? I was, what? I didn't, I was taking back. No. <laughs> Mistakes were made. Some people think a tomato is a vegetable, but... Close an application. <laughs> Yo, legitimate, it's night time! What the hell? And that's why I believe we are truly blessed to have so many different types of potato to choose from. What are you... What? Oh, goodness. Oh, God. How long were we talking? Did you guys even eat, sleep, anything? Well, we gotta get ready to sleep. We can't Why sleep! There There's no I have to build a house! Oh god, no! Well, we finally grown our first furrowfield cabbages and they're absolutely beauties. It's been so long since we've had a proper crop. What with those horrid spoil spores appearing all the time and ruining the soil. In fact, I've never seen a better cabbage in all my life. Thank you so much, Jules. Blimey. What? These cabbages... Whoa, what is this guy's accent? Uh, did you and Rosie really grow more? Maybe, okay. All more reason why we should shun her accursed presence. Come along now, Perry, we're leaving. Uh, yes, sir. I would, what? I would hate to have him in the Salem Witch Trials. He Why would just Beardy? Like, literally kill everyone. Yeah, that guy's kind of a douche. Why is Beardy got such a grudge against builders? If anything's accursed, it's that dead dog on his chin. <laughs> I wouldn't say it was a grudge, really. He's just being cautious. After all, everyone knows that builders I'll... spread desolation and despair wherever they go. What? What is that? Why? I'm confused. Don't worry, Jules, I don't think builders are harbingers of doom and gloom. In fact, I think they're great. Bonanza spent his whole life being told how awful people like you are. We all have. You can't... Am I in the future or the past? You can't expect him to change his mind overnight. Oh, by the way, something occurred to me while we were waiting for the cabbages to come in. Did you see that big bell there? Well, there's an old story behind it. Please don't talk for another 12 hours. Once upon a time, a builder came to Furrow Fields. He showed oh the people the wonder God. of building to earn their awed appreciation. And he whacked that bell with all his might. When the islanders heard it rang out loud and clear, something awoke within them. They were filled with the power of creation. Furrow Field Farm flourished. Don't you see, Jules, those funny things you've been picking up must be pieces of our appreciation. Which means something might happen when you ring the bell. Well, there's only one way for sure, to know for sure. Go over the... Oh my god. Yeah. Okay. That's great. Just ring a fucking bell. You don't know what that rings. Okay. I had to press... Wow, that's a lot of hearts. Power, puff, power! Did you guys become girlfriends? Pretty much, from all that? Base level one. Why do you gotta ruin this for me? The residents awaken to the benefits of building. The residents want to till the field. The residents want to water the crops. They should want to do this to live. I should have nothing to do with it. Am I gonna learn how to make a bell? Uh, soft wood, floorboard, ooh. I like it. It's a lot of things. I don't know what you just did, but it was pretty spectacular. It's just like the whole place has been filled with some kind of strange power. That's right, Malra. 
Malroth. Coming Sorry. from that guy that destroyed the. Well, he doesn't okay. know that. And he didn't destroy the world. He tried to, and then he got killed. Oh, he tried to. Marauding. I can't with this accent. What have you done? What is this energy flowing through me? It's called Gatorade. Me old body's been filled with a yearning to create. I've got an uncontrollable urge to go into the field. I hope this would happen. All the power you collected unleashed when you rang that bell it opened our eyes to the wonder of building. It looks like it even inspired you. Now you can build the simple tools, simple small table, and chest. Is that so? We could certainly use some furniture around here. We could make. Oh my God! I don't want to talk when that you guy sure talks. You got, you, you All sure right, you got some questionable friends. Like They're I not. I just met them. Know. They're not my friends. From now on, you will have full cooperation from Perry and I. Let us rebuild this great farm and restore the place. So I just hypnotized them. All of a sudden, he likes me. We shall tend the field from the moment we wake up in the morning to the moment we fall asleep at night. No crop shall remain unwatered on my watch. That's fantastic, isn't it, Jules? Now we can all work together to see Furrow Field reborn. Residents will behave differently depending on the time of day and the type of room they're in. They're entitled to lives outside of farm work, you know. Well, fuck you, I got that. What the fuck? They uh, they went. That went even better than I imagined. Who the thought? Blah 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 blah. It seems that they. Uh, oh God. Emotions overflow and turn into funny fragments that only you can see. And then when you collect enough of that emotional energy and pour it into ringing the bell, everyone becomes better at building, including you. If I'm right about this, and I'm sure I am. These overflowing emotions are the key to getting Furrowfield Farm back on its feet. Collect as many as you can and make us all the best builders we can be. I cool. feel like she's like an HR to a corporation. I really don't want to help her anymore. <laughs> I, I, I want to go home. Where's the map? There's Furrowfield. Oh, where was the dock again? Well, there, well, there's a lake over there, so you can go. You know, you shouldn't go drown yourself. What the fuck? Where'd the boat go? Did he die? What is this? Nah, he probably took this and said, "I'm not doing this right now. I'm going home." Ah, oh, we gotta go back to the farm. Oh. There was a the, the dude who owns the boat. Oh, people are sleeping outside. Well, you know, that's a them problem. I'm not sleeping outside. I uh I I deserve better than that. Excuse me. Don't we all? There you go. I need some sh I forget, how do you build the mattress again? Where is it? I need dry grass. Oh shit, I can build a storage chest. I'm actually going to build that. How much dry grass did I need? Three, so to make two I need at least six. Come on, you bastard. Walk away from the monster. Oh, forget the NPCs. I'm gonna sleep. So the NPCs don't affect this game either? No, their happiness does affect the game. It's just in that the, I I need to build them places to sleep too, so they can be happy and stuff like that. 
but uh, I didn't feel like doing it in that moment. There you go. Oh, I gotta eat. Ah. Hey, Bulma. Okay, now that Bonanza and Perry are finally in the mood to help, we can take Operation Furrow Field to the next level. Right, problem is, a farm needs soil and seeds. And it looks like you're fresh out of both. Well, um... He called you out, bitch. Any ideas, Jules? I'm not a farmer. Ha! For a mob who hates builders, you lot certainly seem to be lost without one. What's the story there anyway? What's so bad about builders? Come on. Let's get to the root of this. Yes, please. Of course, the root. Well, I suppose, suppose it's more of a bulb, really. Whatever it is, it certainly isn't a cabbage. This can be the next thing we grow. Here you go, Jules. What? What the hell is that? Looks like pie. I always suspected it might be... Where did that beam of light come from? Special, so I kept it hidden away this whole time. While the camera suddenly super zoomed. Yeah. Huh? Hey, Jules, get a load of that. I'm. Cutscene. The platform is going. It must be because you're a builder and you're holding the bulb. Go on, Jules, plant the light bulb. How did you know what it was? You said you didn't. Yeah, all of a sudden it has a name. She gathered those seven of the Dragon Balls. That's why it's beaming. Jules gently presses the light bulb into the soft soil. Did I do it? Jack what? in the beanstalk! Could, that, could this that, be? That does not. Oh, fiddlesticks! We've really gone and done it this time! The Master of Destruction is sure to strike us down! The Master of Destruction? Who the heck is that? What? Have you really never heard of the Master of Destruction? Does that mean you don't know about the children of Hargon either? I see. You weren't just playing dumb. You really don't know about the evils of building. We've been talking at cross purposes this whole time. Let me explain. Everyone at Furrowfield follows the teachings of High Priest Hargon, handed down to us by his illustrious children. On this island, building isn't only forbidden, it's a serious sin. It's what? Rosie? Rosie! We're in a oh, oh my god, fuck. You're in trouble, I get it. Hey, Jules, look! Oh, it's just some monsters? I'll kill them. This is a joke, come on. It's not a joke. It's ghetto you heard Batman. That sound. What in the name of Hargod is happening here? I'm just gonna go kill him. Excuse, excuse me. I can't just kill him? Yo, why is this camera so zoomed in? There you go. Who planted this tree? Answer me, faithless wretches. I did. What, what, what? Building a farm, you say? Heresy! I dare you sully my island with sinful stain of creation. You will pay dearly for this. Uh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. The fields and the cabbages were my idea. Don't punish Jules just because she's a builder. A build? Why did you tell him that? Is he like, like Team Rocket or something? Like, is this, like, no, there's more. That he's just a priest for the church. You see my guy right there, Mal Malra. Well, yeah. when he died, everyone who thought he was right, all the monsters, started a religion in his name. And this is, but they don't know what he looks like as a human, so they don't know that's him. Could it really be what? You know something about it? Then spit it out. If I am not mistaken, this is a young die tree, the sacred sentinel of the furrow field forest, beneath whose blessed bows this isle once flourished. Hmm. Hear me, my wayward vessels. I have had a change of heart. I have seen the fruits of your labors, and I have decided to forgive you for your sins. My superiors need not know of your arboral indiscretion. I will keep your secret so long as you keep growing this tree. But should it dwindle and die, then so shall you. Grow the tree, but I don't really know how to. You need not worry on that account, my child. Furrowfield's most ancient legend tells of exactly 
one what one must do to see a dietary grow tall and strong sowing the seeds of success one you must harvest 15 cabbage oh my god okay just just get to it i suggest you seek out more yourself 50 shaves of wheat okay okay you must till 50 blocks of earth that's all I really gotta do? It's not that bad. I've heard of this so-called die tree. It was once a mighty magical tree that protected all life on Furrow Field, or so they say. If that's true, if that really can grow a new die tree, then we might be able to bring light to okay. Hold on, a creepy monster turns up out of the blue, and suddenly you're going along with everything he says. What makes you think he can be trusted? We have close. a live one, I see. Such a spirited soul would make a fine offering to the master of destruction. Don't make a fuss, Malroth. We're not in a position to argue here. You too, Jules. I can't do this without you. Please say that you'll help us grow the diet tree, blah, blah, blah. Do we have uh, an option? No. Yeah. No a wise decision, young builder. Should you lose sight of your goal, I would bid you speak with me once more. I don't know what we're going to find. A week? Okay, blah, blah, blah. Just come on. Okay. Let the mission begin. You've got to be shitting me. Well, here's what I'm going to do. Why is the land spoiled? It was just nice and green. I was hoping it'd stay green. Okay. No, you're the overall mission. Here we go. What do I gotta do? Yeah, I, I'm not reading this guy. His his accent is fucking crazy. I gotta grow 50 cabbages. Oh, that's nice. But how? I mean, I still got some more to plant, I guess. How did she get the water? I don't know. Water does. A stream doesn't work like that to begin with. But... No. Well, I'm sure somehow it's recycling. I just don't know how. Or maybe it's because this water, that those blocks are poisonous. I don't know. There's magic in the game. I can't explain it. Harvest cabbage. Where do I get more cabbage seeds? Hey. You had one of them cabbages yet? You went to all the trouble to grow them and blah, blah, blah. Yes, look. Wow, you really just wanted me to eat it? Asshole. <laughs> Who dares speak of ill of the- Yeah, God, shut up. Oh, come on. I could kill this guy with my eyes closed. They just won't let me. Hey, Hercule. Uh, builder here says, so okay, for instance, well, can you not? Convert your bedroom into a sleeping quarters. I know, I've been building. Alright, so that means... Wait, I want you to take that beaten up old room, the one with the nice red door, and turn it into a bedroom for me. You can build it however you please, but I think a charming cabin built from soft wood and floorboards would be nice. Keep it the local style. My girl, the room absolutely must have two piles and lights. Oh, that's it? I already got one. 
I just need more dried up bullshit. Here, look, I'm gonna steal it. So, not what I meant to do. There you go. I'll steal this. And now you have a light source. <laughs> Not sure how I did that, but I did. Ah, shit, no! Crap. Well, there you go. Damn it with the dry grass. I literally just said it and I didn't get it. There you go. Keep dropping them hearts. John, give me some commentary here. Yeah, <laughs> While I do the sorry, boring parts. Kinda, it was so kind of hard to like really make stuff off of this. Well, I mean, I don't care. Yeah. Kill time. It's in this part right here. They're acting like I don't know what to do. I've made it this far in the game. And yet they're, they're still talking like I've never done it. Yeah, it's like fucking Scooby-Doo in a gang over here. Except it's Hercule. He's actually kind of pissing me off with his stupid beard. Alright, I think I did it. That should be enough for this guy. Uh, yeah, I know this already. Oh, look at all the hearts. I was gonna, I was gonna say, you lazy asses. Are you gonna go I made this now? guy cream his jeans. <laughs> oh my god, I understand if you need all the seeds I intend to roll. Okay! Oh, th they're just gonna give me Yay. the seeds? How come the last guy didn't give me seeds? Because he was a cheap bastard. What do you expect? Okay. What more do you want? Uh, what will you do while you wait for the cabbage? You can build this a little... Oh, okay, but it needs a bit... Finish it with some farming tools and a nice stack of firewood, wouldn't you? Wait, the bedroom needs a set of farming tools. And need... Oh my god, this guy is so needy! But you're the only builder that's around, so hey. Alright. What did he... I can do this. And now I just need two pieces of stone. It's just I don't see why he can't do that. It's not not fucking rocket science. Alright, there you go. I better get some more for this shit, man. Small farmer's bedroom. Oh, don't drop the hearts outside. Come here, bastard. Stop moving! No doubt you noticed you just made a farmer's bedroom. If you've never built, how do you know that? That's a good question. Another sample of my beard's bounty. He only gave me two. This guy's as cheap as they come. She seemed to like that. I feel like you do anything to please her, she'll be happy. Where did he go? I'm sure he has another quest. He doesn't. Huh. 
This is a little weird. Oh, how the hell am I supposed to get more? I don't even have any wheat. I gotta do 50 of those. What the shit, man? Someone help me. Oh, yeah, maybe I gotta ring that bell, like they said. Let's do it. Uh, resonance will tend. Yeah, okay, let's do it. Oh, I'm, no I'm nowhere near the next level. 296 more hearts. I wish I hadn't hit wow. it because they were working. It said it on the top, but I didn't read it. <laughs> so what am I supposed to do? Nothing. Okay, we'll Does be right back when all this shit is said and done. Wait, look. We got the cabbages. The tree oh, is shit. growing. We did it. We completed the first task, and I think the day trees are already looking stronger. Not bad at all. Maybe I will finally have something truly worth destroying. Shall I burn it alive, or simply blast what? it into splinters? It. Oh, what's he gonna do that for? Did we just get all that for that? What? I don't. I still gotta finish it. It's not done, so it doesn't matter. All right. Okay, so we're continuing. Now, to get the wheat, eventually this Bulma ripoff is gonna give you a quest. All you do is talk to her. She'll just, it'll happen randomly after like a day or two. I still don't know how to get the, to make the field bigger, but I'll figure that out. For now, we go off to where she wants. Who's this rat? Oh, I've been through here. Hello, human. Normally I would give helpful hints about the vibe, but something has... There used to be the most wonderful gran granary. Blah, blah, blah. By the way, the fat rats on this island aren't like the other monsters. We're always friendly and try to help people whenever we can. If you can run into... Okay. Cool, I'll talk to you guys. Fat rats are friends. Fat rats are friends. Not, Not food. food. <laughs> I'm gonna kill the skeleton because I don't like him. Oh shit. Yeah, this guy has the worst fucking aim in the world. Ow! I moved. Oh. He's gonna miss. Get him! Boom! Move away from the slugs. I just wanna go to the area so I can collect the wheat. A castle? <laughs> Jules, get a load of this massive building. Do you reckon there's seeds in there? There's only one way to be sure. Let's head and have a look around. It is really big. That's... What she okay. said? Yeah. Hey. Hello. A oh, person! Really Hello. First I can attack my monsters, then my weapons break clean in half. I can't even. It's totally an anvil, like right there, but I would just die if I had to actually make something. If oh, only God. someone would offer it. Really? Oh, but she'll give me seeds. Lazy dick. I can make you the cypress stick. Give it to Brittany. <laughs> OMG! Wow, really? This cyber wow. stick is, the, is a goat! <laughs> Greatest of all, who are you and where did you get this weapon? I made it. 
You made it? No way. What did you say? You're a builder too? That's just too much. You're crazy. Well, crazy or not, I owe you one. And now you've got a weapon, blah, blah, blah. Oh, I'm getting some, like, seriously sketchy vibes here. What? Oh no, not more of those places, like right on top of the ants, and as I covered so many of them on the way here, and my sword literally broke. Like, literally. She has I that. Like talking to a blonde. Oh, wait, it, but she is blonde. blonde. Can you guys give me a hand with this one? If we all pitch like, in, oh we'll slay these ants in no time. Alright, let's do it. Shouldn't be so bad. Oh my god, this sticking icky. Ow! Ah, oh. ah, ah. Wow, 47. That's right. That's 49. Right. That, stick that, was, that was easy. The Iron Ants are defeated. I love that high five, John. Tell me this is the greatest high five ever. That was it so lit! Right. We totally crushed those ants like like ants! And I couldn't even have done it without you. This sweet oh cypress stick. Wow, I'm so hyped right now, I feel like I'm bursting with excitement. What? Oh my so God. anyways, you said you're a builder, right? What's up with that? What are you doing in a place like this? Get out of town! You're looking for wheat seeds so you can rebuild for a field farm? Man, you're totally gonna get some, like, divine retribution for all this. The master of destruction will seriously smite you. <laughs> Still, you defo seem to have a knack for this whole building deal. This cypher stick you made me is legit. Maybe building isn't that bad after all. Here, take these. They're the seeds I promised to trade for the stick. Better late than never, eh? Ba -da -da -da. My name's Brittany. I'm like a wicked strong soldier. Let's head back to this farm of yours. I want to see what those wheat seeds you grow into. I can't even plant them. I don't have any fucking feel. I'm telling you, these relationships are really questionable at this point. You think I'm lying here or making fun of this game? I need clean soil. Well, we got that. We only got five, though. We need 50. Well, I mean, I'm sure if you break it, it counts as more than one. But how the hell do I make the field bigger? Like the field was already that size when I got here. John, I need you to brainstorm. Got a blast. When to the, well John, I meant like Google it. literally brainstorm I was like uh yeah brain blast wait a minute is this clean no it's purple yeah. damn it oh. hey look there's light over there What about just hitting the regular ground? Would that count? Like, but the regular ground. Game? Hold on. Blah blah blah. It doesn't matter. That's not a bad idea. We might find some willing workers to go to take back to our own town too. Speak of uh, uh, here. I made you something. To put. Okay, cool. A bag. A bag. A bag. With that bag, you can collect as many materials as you like. You'll never need to worry about leaving anything behind again. Hey, I mean, at least it's useful. Alright, Jules, let's plant those wheat seeds. 
we have good enough soil to plant them, you can always knock out some of the cabbage seeds with your hammer and make space. Your bag can hold an amazing amount of items. Select an item, okay, and select open bag. I mean, I thought you had a bag to begin with. But okay. Oh, wow, that's a... No, I just had my pockets. And I was just carrying what was on me. This is a good amount of stuff. Put away? Yeah. Look at that. That's good. Oh my god, I'm gonna starve to death. Yummy. Can I join you? Yes, you may. Wow, this place is lit. <laughs> Is that the day tree? It is, isn't it? And get a load of this sweet farming setup you've got going on. So I'm a soldier, right? I'm more of a breaker than a builder. I want to help out though. So uh, I figure I might stick around and guard this place for you. Blah, blah, blah. Okay, here, here I'm not going to keep doing that. Brittany joined Jules' team. Yay! If there was a sword, I would. If I was her, I would literally fall on top of me and kill myself. Yo, it's the way she talks is annoying. Cool. Well, now. So this is how. This is how we're gonna... Japan actually views this. What? Um, this is really. <laughs> American? <laughs> yeah. Oh, look, John, that's where I did one of those mini medals. Is that a carpet? How's this? I thought that was blood for some reason. I don't know why. I can't destroy it. It's jello. There's an inscription carved into this. Read it? Yeah, sure. I leave these puzzles as a challenge to any young builder who finds them. And they aid you in your journey to become a master builder. Use your wits to solve them, blah, 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 blah. blah. Inscription is there. Whoever wrote this, they sound pretty full of themselves. Well, whatever. Okay, so... Is this a shot at the Ten Commandments? Oh my god. What is the... thing here? Oh, what the shit? Ow, oh, you fat... Go fight? Bitch. Bitch. Ah. He's dead. I think... I think... I know what I have to do. Hold on. I ain't gonna lie though, that tablet seemed like a whole, like, shot at the Ten Commandments at what she said. What do you mean? Like, she's like, whoever wrote this is full of themselves. Well, he said that. She doesn't actually talk. Oh, I mean, talk. he did. Okay, I got a mini medal. Okay! John and I will be back with this fun message. Okay! So at some point, people... Brittany here what monsters appear at the base well Brittany here is gonna give you a quest that's that quest is how you get the clean soil Hello? Brittany I thought you were supposed to protect this place Wow that's it that they're broken Wow okay <laughs> whack attack whack attack whack attack Oh there's only one left where's he going? Run from me. Okay. So, John, let's go, uh... Let's go kill... Wait, what? Did I just get another quest? Now that Wrigley's on board, this farm's about to seriously go off. Any ideas? Practice? Blah, blah, blah. I don't know what the hell she saw. A stone sword. Oh, she wants a sword. Well, she can kiss my ass. She needs to work. But she's gonna give you a quest, knights. And that quest is to meet that worm, Wiggly. And Wiggly can go and turn the soil clean. 
So we're gonna go find Wiggly. We're gonna bring Wiggly back with us. I should have made that stone sword though, just for me. That is a big fucking pig. And I think he's coming towards you now. Is he? Nope. No, he's I'm not. not. Okay. I'm not. It's a. It's just a rat. Is that just a magic globe? Squeak, you're looking for someone who can clean dirt for you. I've got no idea how you'd even go about it. Mud much and mall sir, blah blah blah, if you know to meet him. Quick, I saw a guy for the children of Hargon running, okay. Oh, before I forget, have you spoken to my fine friend over here already? I suggest you see what he has to say. All those rats, oh my fucking. Beautiful behind me, and player. I don't believe that they are telling the truth. It's a fucking glow. Wow, he was telling the truth. I can fast travel here now. Okay, I need my map back so I can fucking see. Let's go. Okay, the next destination is that way. Oh, it's about to be fucking nighttime. I don't like traveling at night because the monsters are a lot more powerful at night. Mr. Worm, are you here? Please tell me the worm is here. There he is! I see him. Hello, worm. Oh, you're gonna attack my worm? Finally found you, Spineless. We we're making clean earth. You know the penalty. Blah, blah, blah. What do you think you're looking at, human? Okay. I'm just gonna murder them. Come on. Take this huge ass wood. Come on. Mm. That baby look ugly as hell. He dead. He dead. He dead. And he's dead. I love the high fives. I can't. I can't say it. Hello, Mr. Worm. Uh, thank you kindly. Anyway, what are you doing way out here? A builder. You're rebuilding the old farm. Looking for someone who can conjure up earth out of nothing. I said that big old tree was back, so I did. I've been wriggling all over the place looking for it. Blah, blah, blah. That gross slimy thing is going to clean up our soil. I can't wait to see everyone's face when we get back with a giant worm in tow. Name's Wrigley, by the way, and if you get back to your farm before any of our children turn up, that'd be lovely. Let's go. I think I can just fast travel though. But do you need a glow to do it or is it Nope. Oh okay. That's Certain nice. spots you can just fast travel to automatically. There you go. Can I join you? Of course you can. A fourth are to aid the building of the fields. Fail to do so, and we will no further need to keep you alive. You trying to threaten me? Ain't well, but I can't understand what they're saying in this area. I I don't even try anymore. Wiggly joins the team. Okay, does this yeah. mean now I can now? Jesus Christ! Why does the music have to play for so long? I just want, I don't want this part to hurry up. The farming has gone on for too long.
Okay. There you go. I'm going to sleep. By the time I wake up, there should be a shitload of clean soil. John, I think we did it. Here you go, you drop a heart every day. Let me see what I need to make your sword. I just need stone. You hear that, John? That's great. Why are you being such a douche? Because we went through all that work as for fucking regular stone. But okay. I mean, that's a fair point. Well, I already made one sword. Hold on. His weapon does how much damage? That's all I need to know. Is it not here? It's not? Oh, his weapon does 12. This does 18. I'll make two more of these. Because I should be able to equip that freaking sword. Equip. Where is he? Come here. Oh, I can't give him. Can I really not give him a sword? That just seems counterproductive. Oh, come on. Just hurry up, please. Now you know why I was making fun of this. It's just the, the dialogue here is unnecessary. Ching ka ching. Alright, we gotta talk to that worm because I want his ass hurrying the hell up. Why can't I? Ah, oh, crap. I don't think that's what I was supposed to do. Why can't I break the wheat? What's wrong? Huh? You see, you am using scarecrows to mark out where you want me to be. So I should work more magic on the mud around them. Oh, it's beautiful. Way to go, man. Oh my gosh, let me... He glitched. <laughs> what the fuck? Ah, oh, crap, I need one more. Do your job, Mr. Worm. I can't talk to you up there. What do you do? <laughs> Why do you guys like make a formation like it's a cult? Oh, I just, I just, I want to get past. So I appreciate what they're doing, but. They need to stop. Hey, you worm. What? You know what? No, we're not. This has gone on long enough. Boys and girls, I hope you've enjoyed what we've done so far. John and I will finish this soon. And when we do, 
you will get to watch all of it. So please remember to like, share, comment, and subscribe. We will finish off this tilling adventure next time. And as always, we'll see you knights in the next video. Boom. Boom. Look at the worm go. You think he's gonna ever get to this purple side? Nah. <laughs> Oh, that take it back. Hold on, there was one more. We did it, Jules. We did it. 50 blocks of soft, unsullied to... Yeah, that's wonderful. It took you forever. Enough space for all types of vegetables to grow in. Okay. Before, okay. Uh, festival. Look, the deity tree. This is going to be a long episode. I hope you guys really enjoy it. We're working hard. It's grown a little bit bigger and it feels a lot more powerful too. Doing these tasks is really doing the trick, isn't it Jules? Standing before something so precious, I can barely contain the urge to destroy it utterly. The past is acting all funny again. Okay. Now hang on. When you first saw the tree... You said you had a change of heart. What was that about? Silence! I will not stand by and listen to your idle chatter when you have so much more still to do. Stop wasting time and get back to work. Whatever, douchebag. Alright! Okay, so now... Wait, maybe we're not done. Are these done? Well, fuck me. This is great. Oh, no. There's only four. Okay, yeah, we're done. Remember to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Become a knight today. And as always, we will see you knights in the next video. Boom.